Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be pretty, pretty funny. At least I hope so. This is going to be the challenge that's been going around YouTube and it's my husband or my boyfriend or whoever you decide to but in this case my husband is gonna be doing my voiceover I try to make it as simple as possible and easy and like showing the products on the screen and stuff like that so he like knows and kind of has a guide but yeah let's see and I hope you guys really enjoy it make sure that you subscribe for you know newer videos and anything like that I know there's YouTube's having some issues with unsubscribing people and stuff like that. Just make sure you turn on that notification button so it lets you know when I upload a video. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Hi everyone, my name is Alex. I'm Karen's husband and I'll be doing her voice over today. As you see, she's going to start off by adding some type of primer on her eyelid area. Start by grabbing your chocolate bar palette by Too Faced. She's going to use some of this Milky Way. Definitely want to put it all over the area you just primed to make sure you made use of the primer. Next, you're going to grab some caramelo salado. Make sure you put that caramel all over your eyelid, girl. Make it pop. You want people to see you when, when you come into the room. They're going to be like, damn, girl, you look like chocolate. But you can't guess what brush she's going to pick next. She's going to grab some of that cherry cherry. Truffle berry, also scary. Make sure you get it in that, as they say, that V area as you're applying it. Uh, you want it to definitely stand out. So if you don't have enough, keep applying until you have enough. Once again, add some of that Milky Way. You want it to pop or highlight. You want to see some contrast or contour, whatever those words mean. Grab a little more cherry, cherry, truffle berry, add it in there. Keep letting it blend in. You want to see some difference as far as color goes from light to dark, dark to light. Next, we're going to grab a little more primer for the rest of your face. You can see as she applies it, uh, you just want to make sure you spread it around like lotion. Next, grab your foundation. I believe that's what this is. Squirt enough on your hand, you want to be able to put enough on your face and share with everyone in the room. Uh, use your beauty blender sponge thingamabobber and you just want to make sure your skin soaks this all up. If your face feels dry, keep adding more and more and more and more and more. Next, you want to grab your naked stick. This is going to make you feel less naked. The more you apply, the more you're going to see at an EDM ultraviolet party. So make sure you go for a, make sure you go for a tribal look. That's going to better the effect at the nightclub. You're going to look cool and definitely be in the in crowd. As you can see, she's definitely trying to apply it in all the wrong places. You want to make sure it goes in your nose, in your ears, and around your brows. Next, grab your magic brush. You know it's magical because how pink and shiny it is. So you're going to grab some more color out of your chocolate bar palette. And you just want to fill in the areas where you think your foundation and your magic contouring cream didn't go. Next, you wanna grab the biggest brush you have. Actually, what I haven't told Karen is I mixed her brushes with my detailing brushes from my car. Okay, now grab your Café Con Leche palette and you're gonna get this nice cappuccino color on your face here. This palette was made by Anastasia. As you can see, she is just using this to set her face. All right, guys, next you're gonna grab some magic marker and you're going to draw some straight lines in your nose. That's going to help you uh, move a little faster when you're trying to get out of the party and have to use the bathroom. So make sure you add enough uh, of these lines on your face. It'll definitely help you move quicker through the crowd. Next, you're going to grab some of this pink cherry, cherry and you're going to just spread it around on your cheek. What that's going to do is it's going to make you look very angry in the dark. Uh, people are going to see your face glowing and they're going to think you're very upset and they're not going to want to talk to you. Using your Mary Luminizer Highlighter and your recently stepped on brush. And you just want to make sure you get enough product on your face. And of course apply that on your cheekbone area, on your nose. And grab some of that Ballistex you haven't taken out of your purse for 8 years. Apply that so your lips look on fleek. Get some more of that cherry bonbon color and just apply it to all edges on the outer portion of your eye. And just pick another random color. We want to make sure we have kind of that rainbow effect between tan 
dark brown and a Milky Way color. There you go. She has another favorite there. She's applying and you want to put that on the inner eye. We have these two green sticks with their floor is they're going to make your eyelashes grow instantly. As you see, you want to shake the brush as you're using it. Shaking it makes them grow faster. It's like you're singing to a plant. Now as you come to an end, you want to just blow some air out your face. You want to dry all this makeup because if you don't, uh, it's just going to start sliding off your face like pancake batter. As you see, we're going to use some truffle sauce lipstick to fill in the color. This is going to make you really stand out. And when you do all these selfie poses, it'll make you look very, very fancy. Once again, guys, please subscribe to All Things Karen. I promise I won't interrupt so much or make them horrible. But if you want me to come back and do some more weird, funny stuff, please leave her a comment. And I'll jump in as many of these videos as you guys want.